hey youtubers uh, Max from Malaga War Games how are you? Uh, well this is my actually my first uh, mm, let's say part of uh, Nick's uh, New Year's painting uh, challenge this is my first project almost finished my objective markers for my um, well the giveaway from my channel uh, this is the first pack of um, uh, custom of the FT markers it's they are almost done I'm just uh, waiting for the the shade the inks on uh, on the base to, to dry and then I will just uh, apply some uh, dry brush uh, to make this um, brown terrain just more more pop up I'm missing a few few small details on a few of the um, markers but this is the main idea maybe I'm gonna try to um, give more details on the dices especially make uh, the the um, the lights a little bit uh, pop up a little bit more I will I will give a try but uh, for for me not being painting for <laughs> For almost three months, I think it's it's quite fair enough. I make, I made. Sorry, I'm just gonna give some focus if I'm able to. Let's see. Yeah, I made some. Uh, well, each of them are different. I use uh, old bits, old pieces uh, like this uh, ball gun from. I think it's from third edition. Uh, of course, just the number of the dice. So each of them are already mark and they are different here I need to finish this uh, ah, sorry for the focus uh, this chaos marine I'm just painting as a uh, iron warrior I just need to finish the just the details on the helmet and the, the horns with uh, some last gun this is just uh, um, remind uh, the Taran book uh, Iron Warriors versus uh, Imperial Guard. This I try to paint as an Eye Lord. With another different ball gun. This one is from uh, from the fifth. No, from actually from the boxes of sixth edition. This is a really old pieces I got from Eldar from a uh, unsold kit. Really, really old stuff, but it's cool to be honest. And the last one that I need to finish is uh, this uh, Tao uh, backpack with everything. I'm just uh, waiting for the um, the ink to, to dry, and then I will I will give to some details and stuff. So as you say, as you see, sorry, in um, well, in in general, I think they are quite quite okay, quite customized. So this is gonna be uh, hopefully finish for me today I will need later on to add some I want to add some snow uh, some uh, grass as well um, on uh, and maybe a little bit splash a splash of, of blood on the on the dices and this is the next project because uh, we already passed 451 subscribers in the channel and I saw many many people uh, on the giveaway um, uh, raffle which is still available and uh, not many people uh, from the English community join on the on the um, on the draw on the giveaway draw so it's still open I'm gonna I'm gonna link uh, the video uh, on this um, on this new year uh, Nick uh, New Year's painting challenge um, I wanna remind you that this video the first part is in Spanish but if you go to minute 1535 you have the same video in English so it's all the instructions and stuff um, for, for this giveaway and if you are interested in custom uh, objective markers which these ones are the next ones uh, well you're still available till the 6th of February where where I'm gonna just close and make the draw uh, it's gonna be already five prizes you know so two of them for sure is gonna be objective markers or part of uh, dark painting sets sets so it depends of people who join uh, wherever they choose uh, on the priority all the instructions are 
is uh, on the video actually. These are the second options that I made. I'm gonna put some stickers I and mean, some uh, tags here with the numbers. Uh, I'm probably gonna draw on this one. On this one I don't know where I'm gonna put it, the same as here, so I will figure out later on. Maybe I will cut a piece of plastic or something and stock it here and here, so I can just have all of them, and here as well, have all of them with a number, you know? It's like in the barrel here, here, and then I will figure out how to do on the next ones. But I think these are options as well for objective markers, you know, and um, quite available. And if by any miracle we reach, um, what was the number? Um, could be 751, but I don't think so, to be honest, in 10 days, but you never know. Oh no, 10 days, 11 days, something like that. If we reach that number, of course, then I have to make a new set of uh, objective markers just in case. Alright, so this is uh, almost the end of my entry. I'm gonna put you the next uh, stuff. Um, I'm still... Uh, well, actually, I didn't do anything on uh, the next uh, part of the project, which is, which is uh, finishing um, uh, my friend's uh, mythos and, um, and freak. Um, um, custom um, um, characters, which is a, a psyker and a lone wolf. Um, I'm gonna start working on this tomorrow. And as well, I already primed uh, the last of my marines for. Oh, it's full. The last of my marines for uh, my chapters of War Bears, which uh, with the new Traitor Legions and stuff, I don't think they are gonna work for as a War Bears for for quite a long time, to be honest, because the new rules, to be on. I really like it for war bears because it's more like um, a, a pro demon, pro demon army. So what I'm gonna do with these ones? I'm gonna finish painting them. I'm gonna start changing the bases for the new, the new ones. I'm gonna show you. Uh, I was tired of my of my rapax, the my raptor, sorry, um, on um, or rapaxes, yeah, on. Um, on metal, they were falling all the time. Even with uh, with the base full of green stuff, they were falling because the base was so short. So I already started with my with my raptors just to change them for the new 32 millimeters base, which is more solid for them. Uh, I already changed all of them. I need to uh, fix the the chain shorts because uh, they were broken. So I need to pin them because I'm tired of glue them every time and I'm moving them around. I'm gonna try on this uh, 2018 to find on a cheap cheapest way like uh, with with enough time you know with the whole year time to get another two units of uh, of these ones uh, on metal and I'm gonna start with the new units on plastic whenever I can for my um, Night Lords um, Legion but my first priority now is finishing the objective markers, then starting uh, to finish this, uh, just these guys, these six, uh, seven guys, which is uh, just uh, one sergeant for my uh, um, Havocs, and then it's going to be six guys with uh, different uh, options. Uh, I think it's like two of them will be Polter, and the four of them will be uh, plasmas and uh, meltaguns. I'm gonna leave the plasmas and meltaguns just uh, not uh, not um, not glue. Probably I'm gonna uh, do some kind of way to stock them uh, because these are gonna be um, chosen or just space marines with a special. Um, special weapons because I have uh, the all metal um, flamers on this uh, army actually most of these uh, miniatures actually for example this one is just metal you know it's uh, all is my I think the oldest army I have with uh, most of the marines on, on all metal so I just wanna have all of them in just one part together and depends on how it's going uh, 2017 
I will even probably get rid of them but for that I wanna first of all finish have them awesome use them in as many butter reports as I can and uh, then we'll see if I need uh, for my financials uh, to get rid of them but of course give them enough publicity on on, e on um, well on internet just to make somebody interesting on them we'll see uh, anyway because I want to start new projects and stuff and to be honest I'm, I'm quite of I'm quite tired of of the rules that they have on the new um, on the new um, traitor legions and well in general you know and uh, I wanna have uh, the properly army painted the properly legion painted and I have my death guard there waiting for me plus uh, if I wanna use my um, war eaters I have a huge army in the colors of 30k so I don't need space marines with bolters to be honest because I have them on, just on white but who cares you know and it, the same for my for my old, old uh, berserks I have um, like 44 berserkers all of them painting and nice details on the old um, bases I wanna change them as well but step by step because you know it's uh, been a long time since I'm not painting so I'm gonna finish this today and I'm gonna start uh, well basing these ones finishing um, well time to time uh, brother uh, mythos and freak uh, giveaway and then starting with my stuff so that's all thanks for watching as usual uh, cheers from from Spain guys I hope you are enjoying your your painting time and uh, if you have a minute check it out the video that I'm tagging on this one just for the giveaway just in case you are interested on some objective markers this is from death watch or from thousand sons thanks for everything and stay tuned happy wargaming free to check the channel uh, for more content, battle reports and uh, painting tutorials. Please subscribe, comment and like it. You are making us to grow up and really thank you for your uh, time. Once again, happy wargaming.